the tube cutter. This is a tube cutter, a little small cutting device. It is designed for cutting copper, aluminum, and brass pipe, all soft metals. It is not designed for cutting hard metal at all. It has a few parts on it. It's got an adjustment wheel that you can tighten it and raise the little track, which has two little guide wheels here. It also has here a little sharpened cutting wheel, and that's what it cuts from. This particular one also has a deburring tool that pops out, and when you get finished, it's very similar to the reamer that you can clean out your burrs from where you've made your cut. Because what it's actually gonna do is pinch down across the edge of a piece of pipe, and that cutting wheel is gonna dig into the sides of the metal until it cuts it all the way through, and it's gonna leave a little sharp ridge on the inside, and that's what you use a deburring tool. To use a, a tube cutter, you find some tube, and I have a piece of copper tubing here. You open it up, and you bring it close to where the guide wheels, the two guide wheels, sit right on top of your tube. You snug it up, but not very tight, just enough where it won't come loose. You go around in one direction, and then you go back in the other, and then you tighten it about a quarter of a turn. You go around and go back in the same way you came, tighten it a quarter of a turn. Go all the way around it, tighten. Go all the way around in one direction, turn around and come back in the other. The reason you keep going alternating directions, if you kept turning it, say, clockwise, some of these, the, um, the cutting wheels not lined up, it's off a little bit, and it will actually walk and like cut threads going down a pipe. It'll, instead of sitting in one place and cutting through, it'll start walking down the pipe. Go around, tighten, cut. And there it is cut the pipe. And here, you can see it's left little burrs on the inside. That's where we take our deburring tool. And you can buy a deburring tool separate and independent from this. You place it in and you run it around a few times. You'll use a different device to clean the outside, a piece of emery cloth, if you're going, especially when you're soldering the two pieces together. Soldering is the, is the process of using heat to form joints and you use a solder and you use flux in there to, uh, to give it a clean environment in which to work. It's a type of welding. This is the tube cutter.